How do you solve for a missing angle in supplementary angle relationships? Well, first of all, you have to know what supplementary angles add up to. You might want to think about how supplementary angles and straight angle kind of sound a little bit alike, starting with S's, and they both add up to 180 degrees. So again, you're looking for something that makes a straight line along the bottom, something like this. And again, that tells you it's going to add up to 180 degrees. So let's take a look at an example. So here we have 105 degrees for one angle and then X minus five for another. And I can see that they make a straight line here. And so that tells me they are supplementary. So I'm going to start by setting up an equation. So in this case, 105 plus X minus five would give me 180 degrees. So now I have to combine like terms. So I have 105 and minus five. Those are both numbers that I can combine. So 105 minus five would give me 100 plus X equals 180. So now I can kind of imagine, I could rewrite this problem to solve for X. I could do 180 minus 100 to solve for X, which would give me 80. So now I know what X is, X is 80. And now I'm ready to find my missing angle. So in this case, I've been asked to find angle DBE, this angle right here. And so I'm looking for X minus five. And so in this case, I'm gonna take 80 and subtract five, which would give me 75. Now, the other important thing to do after you've finished each one of these kinds of problems is to check your answer. So I know that both of them should add up to 180 degrees since they're supplementary angles, but I just wanna double check that I did my math correctly. So 105 plus 75, gives me 180 degrees. So I know that that answer is correct. Let's look at one more. In this case, I have something a little bit different. I have X minus 35 and X plus 35. So I'm gonna go ahead and set up my equation. Again, I notice that they make a straight line across the bottom here. So I can write X minus 35 plus X plus 35 equals 180. I know that might look a little bit scary, but again, I can combine like terms. So I have two X's, I can rewrite that as two X, and then I have a minus 35 and a plus 35. So if you imagine I get 35 and then I take away 35, that becomes just plus zero. So then I've got two X plus zero equals 180. Well, that's really just two X equals 180. And so now I can rewrite this 180 divided by two to find my X value, which is gonna give me 90. So now I'm ready for the next part. I know that X is 90. Now I can find the specific angle I've been asked to find. So notice there's X in two different angles this time. I have to make sure I find the right angle to talk about. So this is asking me about angle CBD. So in this case, CBD is right here. So I'm gonna be doing X plus 35. And so when I plug in X, 90 plus 35, I get 125. And again, I could find the other angle as well if I wanted, just to be sure I'm right. X minus 35 would be 90 minus 35, which would give me 55. And so I think this is 55 and this is 125, but I can add them together just to make sure that they are truly supplementary. And when I do that, I get 180. However, again, I'm being asked for one particular angle. And so in this case, my final answer should be 125 degrees because that's the one I want to know about. All right, that's it for supplementary angles.